welcome friends in this video another example on a composite functions and their partial derivatives i'm going to do here here u is a function of x y z and those x y z together are the functions of themselves okay now i want to solve this one by converting into composite functions to convert into composite functions let me consider this y minus x divided by x y as r and z minus x divided by x z as s then the function u i can write it as u equal to f of r comma s and this r is a function of what you can write mm, y minus x divided by x y or I simply I can split it and I can write because while taking the partial derivative it will become simple. I will write it as y divided by xy minus x divided by xy. Then here y y cancels and here x x cancels and I can write it as uh, 1 by x minus 1 by y. Okay and it is I will consider this is a function of x y z. Okay this is a function of x y z this is nothing but my r similarly yes also i will write it as z minus x divided by x z and i can write it as z divided by x z minus x divided by x z i am splitting this one because of while taking a partial derivative will become simple that's why i'm splitting this one z z cancels again it is 1 by x minus 1 by z it is also of some function of x y z okay this is my yes okay now what you can observe here is i converted the given problem into a composite function type how it works as a composite function now here you can observe u is a function of r and s and this r and s both r and s are the functions of not only x and y x and z here i will consider this as a x y z therefore u is indirectly a function of three variables x y z therefore for this u there exist three partial derivatives do u by do x do u by do y and do u by do z will exist then how to define using a chain rule do u by do x do u by do y do y do z i will define and i will find it simultaneously okay now do u by do x to define this one u is first a function of r and s therefore two partial derivatives exist do u by do r and do u by do s will exist but i want u with respect to x and i know that r and s are the functions of both x y z therefore there exist a partial derivative with for r that is do r by do x plus and here do s y do x correct this is how to define the chain rule of do u by do x now do u by do r i will write as it is because u is some function of r and s what is that function we don't know that's why i will keep this one as, as it is do u by do r do r by do x r i have defined here r is 1 by x minus 1 by y i have to differentiate partially with respect to x this one 1 by x is minus 1 by x square minus 1 by y is 0 because I am differentiating partial with respect to x plus do u by do s also as it is and do s by do x again here it is minus 1 by x square minus 1 by z is 0 therefore what I can write is do u by do x as 1 by x square into minus do u by do r minus do u by do s i can write correct do u by do x let me call this equation number one in the same fashion i will define do u by do y and i'll calculate for this one okay now do u by do y how to define do u by do y i can define it as again what is that u is a function of r and s first therefore do u by do r and do u by do s and r is again a function of x y z but i want partial with respect to only y therefore it is do r by do y 
and yes also i want with respect to only y therefore do s by do y again do u by do r as it is do r by do y here r we have defined it as what 1 by x minus 1 by y is a r therefore 1 by x partial derivative is 0 minus 1 by y partial derivative is minus 1 by y square already one minus is there this one okay plus do u by do s as it is do u by do s do s by do y s is 1 by x minus 1 by z no term of y is there therefore it is 0 therefore do u by do y i can define it as minus of minus plus 1 by y square into do u by do r this is my equation number 2 like this one more partial derivative exists for u with respect to z that is do u by do z i will write it as using chain rule do u by do r into do r by do z plus do u by do s into do s by do z do u by do r as it is do u by do r as it is do r by do z okay and here you can check r is a no function of z the term is there therefore it becomes zero partial derivative is zero plus do u by do s and do s by do z s is nothing but 1 by x minus 1 by z with respect to s will become zero minus 1 by z partial derivative is minus 1 by z square correct simplified form i will get it as do u by do z equal to 1 by z square into do u by do s this is my do u by do s using these three partial derivatives and lhs what is that 1 by x square do u by do x 1 by y square uh, plus z square do u by do z equal to 0 i have to prove let me consider this lhs okay and substitute in that consider consider x square into do u by do x y square into do u by do y z square into do u by do z x square into okay do u by do x how it has to find do u by do x it is 1 by x square into this okay this is into 1 by x square into minus do u by do r minus do u by do s plus y square into do u by do y do u by do y is this one 1 by y square into do u by do r plus z square into 1 by z square into do u by do z do z is do u by do s simplify this x square x square cancels minus do u by do r minus do u by do s will remain y square y square cancels plus do u by do r will remain plus z square z square cancels do u by do s will remain again minus do u by do r plus do u by do r minus do u by do s cancels which is equal to again 0 what is the required answer like this we can use the composite functions to find out the partial derivatives like this some more examples i am going to solve in my next videos if you not have subscribed my channel please subscribe my channel don't forget to hit the bell icon so that you get the notifications of my next videos like this video comment and also share this video thank you friends